Hey y'all, what's going on, my babies? If y'all want to see how I achieve this cute little hairstyle on Nini, just keep on watching. Hey, my little babies. Welcome back to our channel. We are back. Hopefully, with you guys, forgive us for being away for so long. But that's another story, another video for another day. Okay, today we have this little cute hairstyle for y'all. Hopefully, you guys enjoy. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Okay, and please forgive us once again, please. <laughs> please forgive us, please. <laughs> so, yeah, hopefully, you guys enjoy this video. So right now, I'm just making sure everything is straight and I'm also applying the shiny gem in a black and yellow jar. I'll make sure that I post the picture at the top corner so that you guys can know the correct jar that I'm talking about. Because some of y'all may get the wrong jar. I've had that happen plenty of times. So I'm going to make sure I post the picture and show y'all um, the jar that I use. And I really love it because it slicks my baby hair down real good, as you can tell by the video so yeah all i'm doing is part and going straight across like three little parts and just connecting all the ponytails together Look, y'all, make sure these connector ponytails um, is combed out because you don't want to be connecting the ponytails and that hair be nappy. So make sure you comb that baby hair out real good and connect the ponytails, okay? Take your time, part it, comb it out, do what you got to do. So right here, I'm, all, I'm um, making like a little part, maybe like an inch and a half um, wide, and I'm going to comb roll this. This is a protective hairstyle, so nothing has to be too tight. You don't, you don't want the rubber bands to be too tight, this braid too tight, or nothing. Just take your time and do what you have to do, okay? And braid that baby hair, part that baby hair, comb that baby hair, all right? So I'm just braiding it right here. And excuse Nene with this damn cup, y'all. She just can't, she, she can't shake it. She can't shake it, y'all. She, she just can't shake it. around here like i love when my parts are straight i hate like you know like jacked up parts or whatever but i mean make sure those parts is okay y'all and i'm also applying the shiny jam and putting it in a rubber band um i love to brush these little parts because i love clean parts clean like this is a clean hairstyle like i really love that so i have a tendency to constantly go over my parts and making sure everything is straight so like I was telling y'all, do not put these rubber bands too tight because it's already connecting. So one is pulling the other. 
so you don't want to put the rubber bands too too tight because you'll pull them pull out your baby edges or have them with like little pus bumps or whatever and like i keep telling y'all comb them pores out comb her hair out y'all This hairstyle right here, you have a choice to either have um, your connect the ponytails going straight up or you can have them slanted like this. I'm doing it slanted like this because I want like the side ponytail effect look. So everything that I'm doing on this side is going to be slanted slightly to the left. I think this should be to the left. Yeah. So, yeah. But you can like, when you do your two going up to the top, you have to part it like from the nape of her neck, the middle part. Up. so your little so your two little connected things will be going up like that but like i said i'm doing it to the side so i mean it's it's your choice boo it's your choice i hope y'all understood that
So right here, I'm preparing to put Nini hair in a ponytail and I'm combing her hair with my kaleidoscope vent brush. So right here, I'm just evenly separating your hair over this donut. This is the donut that I made from home out of some old black socks or whatever. If y'all, some of y'all may not know how to make a donut. If you would like for me to show you guys how to make donuts, let me know in the comment section and I will do just that for y'all. So yeah, this has been my all-time go-to hairstyle. I don't know why, just the donut wise. Me have been having two donuts, three donuts, four donuts in the head. Baby, I've been doing donuts, okay? I don't, I don't know why. I don't know why. I just think that it's so sleek and elegant. Girl, I just, it, it, and I, I want a donut, but I got natural. So, yeah, I'm applying this little gold bowl to the top of her head, making sure everything is straight, clean looking, making sure the donut is okay. And I'm about to put a little edge control on her edges so that I can carve out her baby bangs, which is already carved out. But I want to show you guys how I do my baby bangs. So right here, I tried to make it like a little, like a little curl in front of her head, but y'all best friend wasn't having it. So I had to go and slick that on back and do my regular little squigglies in her head. Okay. Now Nia was standing up, y'all. She talking about she was tired of sitting down, so I had to, you know, let her stand up or whatever case is. So yeah, I'm covering these baby bangs. Like I would tell y'all, what's a hairstyle without baby bangs? It's not even a hairstyle. Okay. All right. <laughs> So that completes this elegant, cute hairstyle, protective hairstyle. I'ma let Nia spin around for y'all, cause baby, she know her hair is killing it. Okay, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. If y'all try this hairstyle, make sure y'all tag me in it on Instagram or Facebook. I'ma holler at y'all in another video.